Hey there, everybody. Big Malcolm here, and this is my video vlog for Sunday, March 9th, 2014 AD. Okay, so, um, I had a pretty good day today. Um, I'm, I think I'm used to, uh, the daylight saving switch already. Um, <laughs> uh, went to, uh, Old Navy today with my mom. I was looking for a nice jean jacket, and they had two. I couldn't make my mind up uh, which version, so yeah. One was a lighter version, was it? one was that uh, darker version that looked uh, almost gray, so yeah. Sorry, I'm looking up and just checking uh, the weather while I do this. Um, and they both look they both look good on me, and uh, they were only 40 bucks. Afterwards, uh, then uh, my mom and I went to uh, Stone Sound Galleria, and we went to the Gap there. And here's something that a lot of people don't know. Old Navy, Gap, and Banana Republic are actually all the same company, just different prices. And I took a look at their jean jackets at Gap, which is almost exactly the same type of jean jacket as Old Navy, except Old Navy's jean jackets are uh, 40 bucks. The Gap's jean jackets are 80 bucks. What the fuck? And if I went to Banana Republic, it would be well over 100 bucks. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> um... So yeah, that, that place has just gone really fucking depressing over the years. It's 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 all about money now. It's all fucking about money. I, I don't understand it. So yeah, um, when we're done there, we got some uh, food at Sora Bowl. Um, Went to Sports Authority, I uh, helped my mom shop for a knife because she has to go for a camping trip. Uh, she got herself this really cool uh, little pocket knife made by Winchester with uh, real wooden inlay, not the cheap wooden inlay like I see on uh, most times I get, but real wood inlay. Uh, it's a really cool little knife. And... Then I got back home, took a nap, woke up, watched Simpsons, um, watched TV, watch, watched uh, Cosmos, watched African Americans Many Rivers Cross, the last episode, uh, 19, like 68 or 66, somewhere around there to 2013. And I know something I didn't before. And I don't think I noticed it before. Henry Louis Gates talks about uh, some of the bits Ronald Reagan signing that anti-drug bill, um, but he doesn't talk about some of the bits Ronald Reagan taking away the people's guns and other weapons they use for self-defense. Not to attack people, not to blow their brains out, not to put a hole in their stomach, but for self-defense. Everybody, the Black Panther Party wasn't about killing people. The Black Panther Party wasn't about getting whitey. It was about everybody coming together no matter what color you were, and working together to make a better place to live. That's what the Black Panther Party was about. The new Black Panther Party, the assholes that use the original Black Panther Party's name, is about killing Whitey. So, yeah. Not the original Black Panther Party, but the new Black Panther Party is about killing Whitey. So, yeah. Um... So yeah, I find that really strange. He did he didn't talk about that. So, um, 
So yeah, and now I'm just watching uh, the weather. So. <laughs> and, uh, oh, animal stories. Uh, there was uh, two uh, friends walking together, two uh, young women, uh, a white chick and a black chick. And they had a little dog, a little itsy bitsy dog. Um, and the white chick uh, gave it to the black chick to hold uh, for a moment. The black chick walked over the table holding the dog except uh, she was wearing this top where they had fake fur that looked just like the dog, so when she was holding the dog, it looked like she was lifting her titty up. So, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. She was kind of cute, too. Uh, so, yeah, uh, that's all I really got to say. Um, so, yeah. I don't really have anything else to report, so. Yeah. With that being said, uh, I don't really have anything else to say. And this is Big Malcolm signing out, saying peace out, everybody.